Have we ever wondered how much attention a person spends on something that is already dead? The living mistakenly think that their actions can help the dead and alleviate their sufferings. We believe that the dead receive grace, barakah, mercy, gift, feed, exchange. All religions say the same thing. A person cannot change anything after death of the body. If a person is not spiritually liberated while the body is alive, then after death, he will become a sub-personality, a hungry spirit. The only thing all the dead ones need is our attention of those who are alive. The dead needs the life of the living to satisfy their hunger. The only thing they can feed on is the energy. The energy of attention, which comes from us. The living. All traditions are designed to keep one's attention on that which is dead. Thereby, every time a person remembers the deceased, he gives away his life. The price of each memory is your life. What does this make one feel? Sadness? Sorrow? Fear? But life is given to us in order to become alive. Spending it on the dead is like striving to become a starving spirit yourself and hoping that you will also be remembered by the descendants. Be fed and relieved of your suffering. That they will pray for you. At various times, the prophets warned us, Buddhism, not sons, nor parents, nor close relatives, can protect one assailed by death. Indeed, neither kith nor kin can give protection. Christianity, Gospel of Luke. To another he said, follow me. But he said, Lord, let me first go and bury my father. And Jesus said to him, leave the dead to bury their own dead. But as for you, go and proclaim the kingdom of God. Encyclopedia of Hiding. Do not pray facing towards the graves. Cut on and never offer a prayer on any one of them who dies and do not stand by his grave. They disbelieved in Allah and his messenger and died while they were sinners. A person is subconsciously preparing to become a dead sub-personality. But is it really what we are here for? After all, each of us can become alive and obtain life in eternity. Human has a choice where he puts his attention to his life force. That is the future he gains for himself. Wouldn't it be better to devote your time to gaining eternal life?